YouTube, it's your girl Fluffy7285, and guess what I'm coming to you with today? Now, I just showed you a video, if you watched it at least, <laughs> I hope you did. It was the uh, surprise package that I got from Influencer where they gave me the shampoo and conditioner of Head and Shoulders, their new repair system, which I'm absolutely fabulous and stoked about trying. But this one is about, guess what? This one, this is about the Cosmo Box Box. Um, I'm here to do the review on some of the items that I received from the Vox the Cosmo Box Box. And this is for the 2012. And I just received this, like, again, like, about two weeks ago or so, right before I left for Sacramento. So... I'm just going to go through some of the items that I went through, and I should have prepared a little bit better than this, but I did it. so, um, uh, hold that thought. <laughs> uh, one of the items that I got was this, um, Forever Red by the Bath and Body Works, I think if I'm correct. Yeah, Bath and Body Works. This is the purse size, and it's only two, it's 1.25, it's... 0.25 fluid ounces and if this retails for ten dollars now it has the most oh I love the way this stuff smells I mean I love 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 the way it smells it has this pomegranate smell now I'm gonna read off what it says here to you a touch of red pure ma magic Bath and Body Works introduces you to their new most luxurious fragrance ever as you lavishly spray on this passionate blend of pomegranate and red or the orsomathis and sexy surprises of vanilla rum for a forever enchanting way to fragrance. Everyone will be over, will be commenting you on how you smell. Well, I love this, and I truly, truly would love to have a huge bottle of this stuff. I mean, oh, that pomegranate smell is just over. It's just so good. I mean, it has like a sweet smell, but not overly sweet. It's not going to be like a sugary high sweet. But it smells sweet and sensual and, oh, just very romantic scent. I mean, it's utterly just, oh, I'm loving this stuff. I really am. And it, this is the Forever Red, and I used it while I was in Sacramento, and my boyfriend absolutely loved it, too. He thought it smelled absolutely great. Now, the other item that I received from, <clears throat> from the influencer, excuse me, is these fry... Fry Exxons by Pen Pilot. Now, these are the pens that I received. Now, I am a person who loves uh, writing utensils. I love <laughs> markers. I love stuff like that. I love anything that you could write with. And when it comes to writing with certain items, um, excuse me, I have something going on. And um, so I'm very particular about my type of pins that I use. Now these have, of course, the tribal design on them. But just really cute. It's not that bad. The purple is really girlish and the guy is, of course, the black is really guyish. But overall, I really like them. The, um, the pins are super lightweight. <clears throat> I love the fact that the caps go fit perfectly right over the cap. I love this little part right here. This has like a little rubber, like a little rubber thing on them. And what it, that's great for is to, like, totally pick up and turn pages if you're one of those people who does this with their pins. This is great for that. I love that, um, that it has this. Because I don't know about you, but I always have to do this uh, and flip, flip, flip. With this, I don't have to do that, so no germs go anywhere. So I just kind of flip through. Um, these retail for um, a pack of three for four fifty and a pack of eight for eleven dollars. Now as far as writing goes, these write bright smooth. I mean no skipping, nothing whatsoever. Their flow is beautifully. They flow beautifully when you're writing. Um I don't tend to write in handwriting, I tend to write in cursive. So the fact that there was no skipping and the flow was easy, I love that. Uh, the fact that I got a black and a purple, I really, really like the most, even. Because um, I like having a, a colored pen and a black for professional use. And then this one is usually for play. But still, they're stylish, they're useful. I like the fact that they're light and not heavy. <clears throat> and um, they're absolutely fabulous pins. And I would tell you, if you want to look for some pins, get some of these. They're really great. Okay? Now, um, the next item that I'm going to talk to you about is, let me grab it really quickly, so pull that set thought. Oh, 
Okay. Sorry about that. <laughs> I should have had all this prepared. But is this? Oh, I have to admit it. I love this candy. It was super good. So creamy and tasteful. This was the Ghirardelli, the Ghirardelli Chocolate Gourmet Milk Sea Salt Escape. Now, I'm a person who doesn't like like salty items, so I was kind of hesitant about this. But the sea salt in this was like very subtle and wasn't overwhelming, and it was absolutely fabulous. I even gave some to my mom and my aunt so they could try it out and give me their honest reviews on it. And their thoughts on it was that it was very good and it wasn't as salty as we thought it was going to be. So, and the surprise was that we didn't <laughs> was the almonds that were in it. Oh, it just tasted so so good. I mean. I think this retails for, let me check, the Ghirardelli Gourmet Milk Sea Salt Escape Bar retails for $2.79. If you get a chance and you want to have a little luxury day for yourself and uh, a little pleasure, go for it. It's absolutely fabulous. Okay, now the last item, which this is the item that I'm going to probably be not happy with because I wasn't quite happy with it, was the Venus Embrace. It's not in the case, of course, because I used it. As you can see, it did come with the refill, and the refill is in my restroom, and whatever. Um, it says it has five blades in one. Um, I use this in two, two spots on my body, my bikini area and in my legs. Number one is my legs. Um, I had to keep going over and over my legs. I didn't like that. I was not a pro for this. Um, I usually shave my legs once a month, and I then I don't have to shave them for a long period of time, um, probably like up to three weeks, and then I have actually hair growth coming in, and that's usually with my other brand of um, razor that I use, um, and I tend to buy a pack of five or six, and I, they last me a whole month. Um, I did use this on my bikini area, too. Um, did like the fact that they were very moisturizing, that they were extremely moisturizing. Um, but again, I kept having to repeat going over and over and over every spot that I shaved, and I did not like that. That was just a no on my part. Um, the only pro thing I could say about this was that they are moisturizing strips. So I did have less irritation, um, but overall, my shaving time was doubled, practically tripled actually, to tell the truth, I spent more time shaving my legs and shaving my bikini area than what I tend to. Um, the fact that I had to keep going over and over the same spots two to three times to get that close-knit that close -knit shave um, was not my favorite thing to have to, to do. So, as far as everything else that I received from this Cosmo Vox, uh, Cosmo Vox box for the 2012, I love the pins. I love those. I love, love, love the Bath & Body Works Forever Red. I love the Ghirardelli chocolates. Um, my on the fence with this, um, only thing I liked about the Venus was the fact that it was moisturizing. But as far as razor quality, um, for the price of these, if I'm correct, it says... So they say the Venus costs to three fifty to four fifty per month for blade refills. Um, I won't buy these. That's just my opinion. I have spent money on Venuses before. Um, I've never really truly been happy with their product line. Maybe uh, other people do like them, and if they do, then that's their opinion. Um, this is mine. Mine is I would not purchase these. Uh, I used them because, again, they were free and they were um, for me to try out and to give my honest uh, view and my honest points and my own, my honest thoughts and what I thought about the product. Um, again, I love the fact that they were moisturizing, but as far as a razor and shaving, and the top of my love, I really do have fine hair. Overall, my whole entire body, I do not have coarse hair. So the fact that I now have a whole bunch of hair on my legs, uh, like I said, I usually shave once a month. That is my limit of shaving, maybe twice. But usually I do not shave that often. So the fact that even I was gone for a week and I have 
double stubble stibbles everywhere all over my legs. So these were not my fave, and I think I would go back to my others. Um, but anyhow, yeah, these were not great. So there you go, YouTube. Here is my Cosmo Vox Box uh, review for 2012. And I love the fact that the influencers send me all these items because I loved everything. Um, I wish they would have sent me a bigger bottle of the fragrance. I would have been really excited about that. But, hey, it is what it is. All right, YouTube. Thank you for everything and for watching my reviews on these products. If you have any questions about the Vox, I mean about the Cosmo Vox box and the items that I have received, please feel free to leave a comment down below. And your girl Fluffy will get back to you as soon as she possibly can. Peace out and much love to you from your girl Fluffy. Mwah.